Hi everyone, you're alright? It's Alan here once again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's been very qu it's been very quiet tonight and this morning. Um not a lot been going on. And uh I think the particular reason why is because it's too damn bloody cold outside. And I think we're going to have this for the next few days. Yeah. So. Yeah. Well, well. What can I say? More announcements from Woco. Yeah. It's not looking good for them, really. Because. They've now turned round and said that uh, they're not going to do toys anymore. Yeah. So that's what's happened. Um, I think what it was, um, one of the other things that... Uh, They've started to uh, stop doing. Uh, you can't get a lottery ticket from there anymore. Because they've decided to stop doing the National Lottery in the UK. And also, they've also said that the first thing of that is that they're going to stop doing the scratch cards. Yeah. The scratch cards. So. Yeah. They did get a bailout. I think it was £40 million pounds or something. Yeah. I think it was £40 million, uh To bail them, bail them out. But. Uh, to be truthful um, they're going back to just doing homewares I really do see that um, how can I put this um, I reckon that they'll basically strip back um, all the stuff that they do do now, because um, they do they do toys and stuff like that. They do stationery, um, and I think some of that will go as well. And one of the other major things when I when I've been in there and bought something. It's more dearer than anywhere else. Like, when you go in, let's say you go for, uh, oh, what, shall we say? what shall we put put as? Put this item as um, a memory card. Right? And some of the cards, memory cards, are brands you've never heard of, but they pay, but you end up paying quite a fair bit. And where did they go? Where did they go? I went to this uh, independent called Sales Communications in in my town centre and I must admit the prices there compared to Wilco well I couldn't you know I couldn't get the number of cards from Wilco to 
the other place I go to um, and yeah it's a good uh, good place I go to and I get the memory cards a lot less a lot less than what uh, will call get them for because uh, I think it was integral, yeah, integral. Um, when I go to cells, can cells um, Mr. Harry, Mr. Uh, called, everybody calls him Harry though. Um, yeah, you can get good deals there, and uh, yeah, I've always. I've always been there if I needed anything phone-wise. And, uh, yeah. So, how is everybody? Okay. Um, the bank fiasco goes on. Um, there was a, an instance of this on a, one of my friend's channels. Dan is called the I allegedly uh, channel. Go over to there and give him a like, and tell him that uh, Alan Kane of the Alan Kane's Daily Blog YouTube channel uh, sent you there. Also, the uh, economic ninja. He's. Uh, been looking at some of what's been happening on the uh, American mortgage side. Um, yeah, it's getting pretty messy, folks. Getting pretty messy over there. But the same thing is happening here, you know. And people are uh, up to their eyeballs in debt. Folks, if you can, if you can pay your debt off and get rid of it because it's the worst thing you can ever do. Um, get some professional help. Go to the Citizens Advice Bureau. Go to Step Change and basically get get rid of all your debt because at the end of the day no matter what it's it's gonna back, turn round and bite you it really is I'm just uh, doing this video for you but uh, as I said in my early videos, 6,000 of uh, Barclays staff will be joining the doll queue very soon and they're going to have to go and look for the places at the job centre and get a new job. And uh, yeah, and it's not by, it's not bot just Barclays going to be uh, having that sort of problem, you know, the letting people go. Yeah, excuse me. <sighs> yeah, so it's going to be all across the banking sector. Even Nat West, who are partially owned by the government, I've got a funny feeling that the government is going to start selling another uh, stake in Nat West off very soon, and also they're going to be making 
redundant sis quite a lot of the banks are going to make quite a lot of redundancies because they're basically going to this digital currency and uh yeah they won't need as many they won't need banks then will they uh but you know things things happen and uh yeah we'll just have to wait and see so i'm gonna bugger off bugger off now and uh keep safe everybody and uh be prepared and oh yeah and by the way i did go into black i did go i went into blackburn yesterday and uh i'm absolutely knackered right so it's excuse me yeah i'm ready for a sleep so see us later later bye